At a ceremony held at BE Systems Shipyard in Govan, Glasgow today, work began on the 5th Type 26 frigate. According to current scheduling, HMS Sheffield is likely to enter service sometime in 2031. HMS Sheffield is the second of the Batch 2 vessels, and the program is now well into its stride. She will be the fourth Royal Navy warship to carry the name. Previous Sheffields have maintained strong links with their namesake city and were given examples of stainless steel items manufactured by the steel industry the city was famous for. The first HMS Sheffield was a town-class cruiser and saw extensive action in the Second World War, winning 12 battle honors. She was nicknamed the Shiny Chef, and her wartime exploits are recounted in this excellent book. The second HMS Sheffield was the first Type 42 destroyer, built by Vickers and Barrow and commissioned in 1975. She was subsequently hit by an Exocet missile in the Falklands conflict of 1982 with the loss of 20 sailors. She was the first RN warship sunk since the Second World War and an analysis of the events surrounding her loss can be read in our previous article here. The third HMS Sheffield, a Batch 2 Type 22 frigate built on Tyneside by Swan Hunter, was originally to be called HMS Bruiser but was renamed in honor of the destroyer lost in the Falklands. A victim of defense cuts, she served for just 14 years in the RN, was decommissioned in 2002 and sold to Chile. Renamed CMS Almirante Williams, she was substantially re-equipped, losing her Sea Wolf system replaced by Barak-1 VLS missiles. A 76mm gun was fitted on the foxhole in place of the Exocet system and 8X Harpoon anti-ship missiles were added, 